All right, I've got some awesome news for all the sky watchers out there. After weeks behind the sun, 3i Atlas is finally visible again from Earth, if you have a telescope. So check this out. According to IFL Science, uh, they're reporting that it's appearing in the early morning sky near Venus and Spica, which is the bright star in Virgo. So you can catch it best at dawn right now. But it's not just back, it is changing. So as it hit perihelion in October on the 29th, uh, data from NASA's Stereo, SOHO, and GOES-19 showed that it brightened very quickly and it shifted towards a higher energy blue wavelength. It's probably venting fresh ice and gas, exposing material older than our solar system itself, which is fascinating. Telescopes like Gemini North and Noir Lab have captured jets of material bursting from the surface, one shooting straight towards the sun. So uh, its coma and its tail have also grown larger than many people expected. So it's proof that this object is bursting with activity right now. Meanwhile, NASA has been almost silent about it all. Uh, even the agency's head found time to comment on a celebrity's moon post uh, yesterday. <laughs> uh, China, Russia, the European Union, all very quiet as well, which is surprising. Nonetheless, the International Asteroid Warning Network has coordinated global tracking through January, but for now, it's the amateurs who are watching this interstellar traveler most closely. But full disclosure, uh, visibility of the comet still depends on timing, uh, dark skies, having a telescope that's capable of seeing it. So yes, you might spot it, but don't expect any big fireworks from the naked eye, at least at this point. So I'll update you with any new info that comes out. So stay tuned.